Christmas fun, Christmas fun, let's see Advent fun. Christmas time, we're online, the countdown has begun. Yay! Christmas fun, Christmas fun, let's see Advent fun. Thanks so much for watching, happy Christmas everyone. Yay! Hello and welcome to the Messy Advent Calendar for Tuesday the 15th of December and here's Simon with the rest of the story. So Jesus, God's Son, has come to earth, has just been born on the earth, the most significant, amazing person ever to live, yet it's really humble beginnings. They're in a stable, no one really knows where they are. And when you have a baby, you want lots of people to come around and see it. And you want to tell everyone. So what's going to happen? God must have a plan, surely. Out in the fields around Bethlehem, there lives a group of shepherds hanging out, tending their sheep. Now, shepherds, they didn't really fit in with the rest of society. They were outcasts. Maybe they liked it that way. People didn't really want to hang around with them. They were stinky, they were dirty, they spent all the time with the sheep. They were kind of proper rough and ready. Suddenly, the sky was full of light and an angel appears to the shepherds. Do not be afraid, he says. I bring you great news. Today, in Bethlehem, a saviour has been born to you. He will bring peace on earth to all men. Here's how you know I'm telling the truth. You'll find him wrapped in cloths lying in a manger. Boom! The whole sky is full of angels praising God, celebrating, cheering, saying glory to God in the highest, peace on earth to all men. Whoa! The shepherds, they look at each other. Let's go man, let's go. So they rush off to see Jesus. Maybe they know where all the stables and stuff are in Bethlehem. Maybe they've slept in them themselves. They're the first people in the whole world to actually go and see Jesus and wor worship Jesus. And they're so amazed by it, they rush off and they tell everyone what the angels have said, about the angels in the sky and about meeting Jesus. So Jesus, the king of kings, the greatest person ever to live, born in really humble beginnings in this stinky old kind of stable, met by these kind of stinky outcasts who people don't really particularly want to associate with. Is that it? Well... Stay tuned for next week because there are more visitors to come and see Jesus. Thanks for watching. I'm sure the question mark has got a lot of things about these. Open tomorrow's door to find out what she's got to say. Thanks.